What's up guys and welcome back to Everything Gaming and on today's video I'm going to show you guys how to complete the first Forzathon event of July called Let Freedom Ring where you can win this 1970s Chevelle Super Sport Horizon Edition and the Ferrari 599XX amongst other prizes. So without further ado let's get stuck in. Uh, the first challenge is called Freedom of the Road and it wants you to complete three races in a classic muscle car to win the 1970s Chevelle Super Sport Horizon Edition and 50,000 credits. The next one is called Get Together and it wants you to complete an online adventure to win three wheel spins. Third one is called Bursting in Air which wants you to perform 20 ultimate air skills to win the Ferrari 599XX. And the last one is called Rallying Cry which wants you to complete a race in a classic rally car to receive 55,000 XP and 120,000 credits. Now what I'm going to show you guys is how to complete the first two challenges at the same time, basically kill two birds with one stone. So obviously that first one wants you to complete three races in a classic muscle to win the 1970 Chevelle Horizon Edition and the next one wants you to complete an online adventure to win three wheel spins. So what you want to do is go into your cars and obviously filter it as I normally do and then scroll all the way down to classic muscle. Now obviously you know you can pick whichever car you want it doesn't matter um, you know. I recommend whichever. I would recommend making it all wheel drive because it does make it a lot easier to control. Um, but it's entirely down to yourself. Now you can complete the first challenge and the second one separate. If you want to complete all your three races in single player, uh, you can do it that way. You know, select any three races you want and do it in the single player. But what I'd recommend is doing it in the online adventure. Now obviously the online adventure consists of four races. All you have to do is complete three of them in the classic muscle car to receive the 1970 Chevelle. Uh, and obviously complete the whole online adventure to win the three wheel spins and the second challenge. Now obviously in order to complete a race it means finishing, it doesn't matter where you finish, you know this is the same as single player and online, finish wherever you want. When you are online you're not likely to finish high up because there's always a few twats who want to knock you off the race course uh, and if you do finish first then you probably are one of those twats that knock people off the race course. Um, anyway, like I said, obviously you can see here it says race completed, that's what you want to get and you want to get it three times in your classic muscle car. Now what you want to do as well to win the second one is start win uh, complete a race from start to finish four times complete all of them now the third one is called bursting in air and it wants you to perform 20 ultimate air skills to win the ferrari 599xx so i recommend you come here to all the dunes just outside the airfield now you can do it in whatever car you want it really doesn't matter all you have to do is get those ultimate air skills 20 times now obviously i'm here in my classic rally car here my Ford Escort. Like I said, you can pick whatever one you want. Uh, and the reason I suggest the dunes is because there's a lot of jumps in really quick succession to one another, so you can get the challenge completed in under five minutes. All you have to do is build up a bit of speed, just do the jumps, and you'll keep seeing the ultimate air skill popping up. Just keep doing that for as long as you need to, and then obviously when you get the achievement and the Ferrari prize, it's as simple as that. It's really quick. Now there is other methods to doing it. You know, you can go anywhere across the map where there's jumps really, so in the construction site if you want. Uh, there is also the ramps at the airfield as well if you prefer to do it this way. So this is a second method. Like I said, use whatever car you want. Now this method will take a bit longer, but it might be easier for some people. So just hit the ramps and land it, and most of the time you will get the ultimate air skill. It's not hard at all. Like I said, it will just take a bit longer than the dunes, but it might be a bit easier for some people. <clears throat> Now, the last challenge is called Rallying Cry, and it wants you to complete a race in a classic rally car to receive 55,000 XP and 120,000 credits. So obviously what I did again is I went into my cars uh, and I then filtered it. So I scrolled all the way down and I then filtered it to Classic Rally. Now, like I said, you can pick whichever car you want. I obviously stuck with my Escort RS 1800, but you can pick whichever damn car you want. Uh, and then obviously, all you have to do is complete a race. So I picked my Highway Circuit one as I normally do. Uh, I then blueprinted it just to Classic Rally cars to keep it a little easier. Uh, so I can obviously get it over with fairly quick reduce the laps on it as well and all you have to do is pass the finish line so it's the same with the first and the second challenge you just got to complete the races doesn't matter where you finish just cross the finish line and do not dnf otherwise you won't get them um anyway guys uh, thank you very much for all the support and obviously for watching my videos. I hope these helped you out. Uh, the Forza Thon event starts tomorrow, so good luck with it. I hope obviously all of you guys win the cars. Uh, what I would recommend if you have them now, uh, hold on to the spares and obviously you can sell them later in the auction house, make a couple mil off them. Uh, but anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed. Uh, thank you very much for the support. And if you do want to see more videos just like this, don't forget to subscribe for more. But thank you very much, guys, and good luck with the Forza Thon event.